work centers are essential to master data elements. They represent where the production of goods is actually traveled to. Work centers are quite flexible. They can be configured to represent a person physically doing the work, or they can be a machine or group of machines. It can even be a production facility. Work centers are where value is added to a product. Let's create a work center in SAP. We'll do this by entering transaction code CR01 and press enter. Work centers are plant dependent, so we need to enter the plant where this work center is located. We'll enter plant MI00. Next is a work center name field. This can be up to eight characters. We'll call this work center BKASSY, short for Basco Kate Assembly. Next is our work center category. Let's look at our options. We'll choose works in our category 003 for labor as a worker is going to be doing the work of sampling our kids. Now we press enter. That brings us to create work center basic data screen. Here we get a long text field to better describe what its work center is doing. We'll name it Basco Kit Assembly. Looking at the general data area, we'll go first to the person responsible for this work center field. We'll click the match code to see our options and choose 00, zero for this work center. Next, we'll look at our usage field. In our usage field, we'll choose 009 all task list tabs. In the standard value key field, we'll look at our options and choose SAP1, normal production. We've now filled out all the required fields for the basic data for this work center. Work center can be configured in a very complex way. The capacity tab has fields where we can configure things like start and end times of shifts the factory calendar, and an overload percentage that is allowed. On the scheduling tab, we can enter formulas for setting up, processing, and duration of teardown at this work center. And on our casting tab, we have fields where we can configure this work center for product casting. Here, we can define the cast center and the activity tabs that will feed products casting. We're now ready to save our work center. We'll press save. And we get a success message from the system that our work center BKASSY implant MI00 was created successfully. In our example, we can now use this work center to assemble kits. This work center is now available for us to add value to the product we're manufacturing.